Well, we just got the first two games in the divisional playoffs out of the way. One's an upset, and the other one wasn't. So, let's dissect how these games went. This is Aaron Jay's fan, and this is NFL Playoffs. Okay, so let's talk about the first game between the Minnesota Vikings and San Francisco 49ers. Uh, Minnesota beat the Saints last week to advance to face San Francisco and San Francisco and Santa Clara. Okay, so this game, San Francisco scored on the first ever drive. The Kendrick Bourne touchdown passed from Johnny Garoppolo. Then the next drive is Minnesota's drive. The cornerback for San Francisco, oh my god, what's his last name? Witherspoon? Got a pass interference call on Stefan Diggs. And what did Minnesota do the next play? Kirk Cousins went back to Stefan Diggs. The same cornerback on him. And the quarterback whiffed. Stefan Diggs caught the ball. Touchdown, tied 7 7. But that's we see the end of the day for Minnesota. Ever since the second quarter, their offense couldn't get on track. San Francisco's defense has stepped up. San Francisco took the lead 14 10 going into half. And the second half is off oh, San Francisco. Minnesota couldn't do anything. Her cousins couldn't do anything. The running game couldn't do anything. San Francisco just stopped Minnesota. And as the game went on, San Francisco just kept piling on points and points until a point where Minnesota was way out of reach. Even they got one little drive, they could. They want to win this game. Yeah, so San Francisco, especially from the second quarter on, dominated the whole game. Defense is elite, especially um, Nick Bosa from Ohio State. Six tackles and two sacks. Guys, uh, Beast with defensive end is quick. He doesn't seem that big, but he's quick. He's going to be defensive rookie of the year in the NFL. 100%. So San Francisco will take on the winner of the Green Bay Seattle Seahawks game tomorrow versus the night game. And San Francisco will get the home field advantage next week in the NFC Conference Championship. Now, on to tonight's game. No one expected this. Well, some people probably pick Tennessee to win, but I think most people projected Baltimore to win. I projected Baltimore to win. Lamar Jackson is a beast this year. He's going. People are gonna. People think he's gonna win MVP. I probably think he's gonna win MVP. The guy watched over a, a thousand yards. And Baltimore set the record for most yards rush in the NFL season. But let's give props to Tennessee. They came prepared for this game. I mean. Derrick Henry, that guy's a beast. This guy just runs and bulldozes everybody. Oh my god, I don't know if they hit over 200. Probably had over 200 yards rushing or something. Right? So yeah, Lamar Jackson did not look good out there. He almost threw 60 passes, only completed a little bit over 50% of them. He threw a couple bad interceptions that really killed momentum for them. Um, their offense looked out of sync. Baltimore's offense looked out of sync. Lamar Jackson was frustrated all game. As he should be like he shouldn't he's not happy with the performance. NFC's defense stepped up, did a good job, especially on the receiving core of uh, Baltimore. And now the number one seed in the AFC has been eliminated. So Tennessee has to wait for Kansas City and Houston tomorrow to conclude. And Tennessee, whoever wins that game, Tennessee will be the away team because it's their wildcard team that got in. And I think that's going to be Kansas City. I think Kansas City is going to Super Bowl in the AFC. And I think San Francisco is going to go to the Super Bowl in the NFC. Now, I said my prediction right in the AFC that it's going to be Kansas City. So I'm going Kansas City, obviously, again. Against Tennessee, Kansas City is going to win. 
I'm, I'm predicting San Francisco is going to go to the Super Bowl, but I think Seattle is going to win, upset Green Bay and Lambeau. And I think we're going to see Seattle, Seahawks, and San Francisco for a third time this season, including playoffs. And I think San Francisco is going to win. And you see two teams that Joe Montana played for, Kansas City, San Francisco. So, yeah. With, so that's it. I will view the, the other two games tomorrow. Remember, it's Kansas City and uh, Houston Texans. That's the afternoon game. That's the first game. And then Seattle at Green Bay. That's the night game. Thank you for listening. Sub, like, and comment below. Thank you.